Hey, what's up everybody? Frexkin here. We got a little tutorial for you guys. I know I've been wanting to change the main theme music in Fallout 4. I love the main theme, but I figured I'd show you guys how to change it. So first thing is, you're going to pick your favorite song, blah blah blah, whatever. I'm going to start out here with Trivium. So we got Silence in the Snow. What I'm going to do is, it comes in an M4A file. You need to convert it to a WAV file. The best way you can do it for free is go to media.io. It's a free website. You upload your file, pick your format, and then you convert it. And then you have a download button. Take your file and put it right in your desktop. That's there. Remember that. This is the file we're going to use. So we're going to put the old file right here. Now what you're going to need to do is download a program called BAE, Bethesda Archive Extractor. You can get that right on the Nexus website, nexusmods.com, Fallout 4. Download it manually, extract it with like 7-zip, blah blah blah, Windows Extractor. You're also going to want to download Skyrim Audio Converter 2. This is for when you want to update or make mods for, say, sound effects for animals, blah blah blah. blah. Yeah, but you're going to need it anyway. Okay, so now that we got those two programs downloaded, what I'm going to do is show you guys a quick shortcut. You're going to need to go to My Documents after you have the game installed and you run it once. Go to My Games, Fallout 4, Fallout 4. It's an any file right here, configuration setting file. Open it. What you're going to want to do is scroll down to this line right here where it says S Resource Data Dirs Final. It'll say Strings for now. What you need to do is add a comma, and then in all caps, music slash okay and save your file close that out forget about it now that we have bay opened or downloaded open bay it's a sweet little program right here nice simple click file open file then we're going to go to I actually made a shortcut here I'm going to go to my desktop to the Fallout 4 directory, shortcut right to it. It's in the data folder of your Fallout 4 in your Steam apps, right here. Steam, Steam apps, common Fallout 4 data. Okay, when you get in here, scroll down where you see Fallout 4 sounds BA2. Open. Just select none. Hit this tab here, music, this arrow. Go down to where it says special. And it's the very first one, MUS main theme. MUS meaning music. Okay. And when you do that, extract. Or actually, yes, extract. And it's already going to bring you to the data folder here. Just select folder. Okay. Then you can go ahead and close that out. Now just to prove that it did something, I'm going to go to Fallout 4 directory music special and it's right here now we're going to leave this window minimized now what I'm going to do is take this wave file I'm going to open the Skyrim audio converter and I'm going to convert that wave file so I'm going to click XWM because that's a Fallout 4 sound files play as as shown here XWM click XWM add file Desktop, wave file, and convert selected. As you see, a file showed up right here. That's the XWM file. Okay. You can close out the Skyrim audio converter folder. Take this file right here, hit F2 and you can rename it then rename it and type it exactly how it says in the special folder down here so mus underscore main theme hit enter now what you do is simply just drag and drop it right into that folder replace it's not going to modify your main 
files because what this file right here is it's an extension of your data files because these are all packed together they're gonna stay the same what these directories do when you change that setting in Fallout 4 in the documents you change the directory of the final file of what it's gonna play off of so the file that's inside here will play off of what we just put right here what we just made from that file converted to this one is here now I'm gonna launch Steam just to prove that it works play play still going still going and as you can see that it works fairly well got a pretty decent quality. I also unlocked my frame rate at the bottom left if you guys haven't seen. That'll pop up in a different video. But as for now, this was a Fallout 4 modding tutorial on how to change your main theme music. I hope you enjoy it. I hope it was useful. Subscribe, like the video, subscribe for more videos. I play games as well. If you have any suggestions for other tutorials, I'll try my best to put a video up. Thank you guys. Have a good day.